I feel like half these bitches on the lineup hate me. Um, Konnichiwa. Hello everyone, how are you doing? My name is Kami and welcome back to my channel. I would just like to clarify, yes, my voice is not here right now. My voice actually broke the other day. I finally hit puberty. I'm so grateful to be here. I would just like to thank my parents for having sex and creating me. This is literally so annoying. I don't know why I sound like this. I've been at a festival for three days straight. That's probably why. I'm just so crazy, like getting drunk every day, like smoking so much weed, like fuck. That's a joke. Surprisingly, I don't do drugs. I met loads of you at the festival and you were all super confused that I wasn't on drugs. Like, no offense, stop being rude and judging me. I can have fun without drugs, guys. You guys are just crazy and I'm not crazy and I don't care about it. I'm the type of person that would rather stay in bed than go party and that's the way I like to live my life. If you don't like that, go away. Buy my merch. Okay, anyway, today I'm gonna be going through the Summer in the City lineup and I'm gonna be giving you guys my honest opinion on every single YouTuber on the lineup. This video is going to be extra beefy, hence why I have my cup of tea right here. <laughs> I'm literally so annoying, but it's gonna be a fun time. So yeah, honestly just get ready for this Yeah, I don't know if you can tell or not, but it's low-key water and ice I wasn't really feeling a cup of tea just because it's so hot in my room I, I just I can't be bothered to explain myself like stop talking to me. Do you know what I mean? Wow, suddenly my throat feels better. It doesn't. I still feel sad and upset. Sad and upset mean the same thing. This is why I failed school. But yeah, if you want more beefy videos in the future, get this video to 10,000 thumbs up and I'll see what I can do. I'ma work my magic. I'm so cringe free. Oh no, my Healy sticker is coming off. Does anyone know how to repair this? Healy's, if you're watching, please sponsor me again. I miss you. Okay, anyway, let's actually get on with the video. By the way, if you're sat there not knowing what Summer in the City is, it's basically the biggest YouTube event in England. In America, you have like VidCon, Playlist Live, but in England, England, you have summer in the city and for your guys's information I am actually attending this event so if you guys do want to get a chance to meet me I will be there so go buy tickets. This isn't sponsored This is just so we can meet and be friends I don't know if you actually want to meet me or just like punch me in the face But either is fine like honestly if you want to beat me up. I will let you I'm not lying. Anyway, enough chatting shit. Let's get on with the video, boys. <laughs> okay, so basically what I'm going to be doing is going through the lineup like this. I'm going to be going through every single person and giving you my honest opinion. This will probably be one of the realest videos on my channel, but I'm honestly here for it. Let's hope it's not too beefy. <laughs> I can't make any promises. Elle Mill. I actually recognize her. I feel like she blew up really quickly, right? I think she made a viral video and went crazy. So yeah, she's cool. She seems fun. Louis Cole. I'm pretty sure he eats bugs and shit. So yeah, big up um, him. I don't know. Beauty Spectrum. I don't know who that is, but I think she chatted shit about me on Twitter. <laughs> books and Quills. This girl has books in her name, so I don't really think we'll get along. Cherry Wallace. I think she was relevant like two, three years ago. I don't really know if she's still alive. Hello, it's Amy. Yes, boy! If you guys didn't know, I'm a huge fan of Hello, it's Amy and her boyfriend. They are honestly so lit. I've met them once in LA last year, and honestly, they were so sick. They also remind me of my best friends, Millie and Jordan. Like, I don't know why that I feel like Millie and Jordan are the 30-year-old version of them. I don't know, I love them so much, can't wait to see them. Okay, looking at this lineup, there's way too many people that I don't know, so I think I'm just gonna do the people I actually know. The Shades. I feel like I know them, but I don't know them. I don't know if they've got like a crazy fan base, so if they do, what's up, The Shades? I love your, um, I'm assuming they're a band. Like, honestly, there's so many new bands in 2018, it's kind of boring. Olivia Grace, a hey, she's super cool, can't wait to see her. Steven Tries is really cool, I think he's super funny, I feel like he could actually make me feel insecure. So that's like great fun, I really, really like that. Christine Sadelko, she's super funny. I think she's sick. I sound so fake. <laughs> I literally don't have a clue who any of these people are. Love Evie, A, she's also really cool. I know her. New Hope Club, I've heard a lot about them. They seem really interesting. I don't know if I'll meet them, but like, we'll see what happens. I'm also going to be vlogging Sitsi, so yeah, it's gonna be super interesting, like making this video and then actually meeting them all in person. Emma Blackery, um, I don't really have an opinion on her. I used to watch her videos like four years ago when she was actually popping, but now I think she's kind of dropped off. I don't really know. Know if she's still making videos, I'm not sure. Oh my days, the Midnight Beast are going. I used to listen to their music, I'm pretty sure. That's kind of mad. Like, what's up? Gabriella, I'm subscribed to her. The only reason I know her is because I've heard loads of shit about her and Zoella falling out. I don't know if that's deep or personal, but I'm just saying that I feel like she actually has an opinion on things that's kind of funny. I feel like she's low key beefy, so I think we'll get along, but I don't know if she hates me or not. She probably does. I don't know if you're watching Gabriella, but what's up? Give me a tweet. Eve Bennett, I know her. She makes videos about like books and stuff. Like, she's super smart. We love 
love a smart queen. We don't. It's super boring. Hi, my name's Kami, and today I'm going to be making videos about math. If you guys want more tutorials on how to add up to six, listen up. One plus one equals two, and two plus four equals eight. Lee Hinchcliffe, um, that guy's a little rap. Lee Hinchcliffe was one of my first YouTube friends, and then we just didn't really see each other for a long time, so Lee, if you're watching, you're a snake, and I don't like you. It's Loki, his birthday today, so happy birthday. <laughs> Joe Tasker, same goes with you. I think Joe's just always busy, so I never really get to see him, but like, I do really love him loads. Doug Armstrong, I know him because he looks like my friend Ben. They are literally the same person. I'm gonna put some pictures on the screen now so you can actually see for yourself. Isn't that kind of crazy? Like, what? Boxosaurus. The only reason I know who she is was because she copied one of my friend's videos ages ago and didn't give them credit. So yeah, carry on stealing those video ideas. Tessa Brooks, like, hey, Is that your boy's cologne? If I don't end up partying with her, I'm gonna be super pissed off. Anastasia, um, yeah, she's cool. I don't really know what to say. Like, yeah, she's cool with friends, I guess. Me and Anna have had so many ups and downs in our friendship, but I feel like we'll always be friends. I think there's just a massive block in the way of our friendship. But like, I don't know if any of you will understand what I'm speaking about, but hopefully it'll be sorted soon. Who are these people? I don't recognize anyone. The new Adam B99. Hey, my guy. He's literally the nicest person ever. I love him. El Toria, aka my mom. She's sick. Elmo Films, like, you're kind of butters, but I do really like your videos. You're really, really cool. Kira Bridget. Oh, my honest opinion on Kira Bridget. I'm actually gonna be so serious real quick. So obviously some of you may know that me and Kira used to be pretty much like kind of best friends. She was kind of in my YouTube group and then she basically met a guy with 3 mil subscribers and then just like kind of ditched us. It's obviously like fair enough but like honestly it's probably the best decision she's ever made. Only in the YouTube side though because she's low-key got money and clout now. I just think she's super smart. I hope she is happy though because I don't think she has that many friends apart from Morg. Kira if you're watching I hope you are doing good. I don't don't hate you and I think you're a smart girl and I miss you loads. JMX. I'm best friends with JMX so I don't really have- Wait. My bad. I mean, I'm best friends with JMX's brother, so yeah, JMX is cool. Dodie. I'm pretty sure she sings and stuff, so yeah, she sounds really cool. Oh. Jordan Lipscomb. Now, this is super interesting, so I met Jordan at, like, Big Beauty Day Out or some shit. She was one of the funniest girls I've ever met, and I feel like her personality doesn't come across that well in her videos, like, in person. Like, legit, when I met her in person, she had such an energy, and I freaking loved it. So, Jordan, if you're watching, I can't wait to see you at Sitsi and Party It Up again, eh? Saffron Barker. I went to the festival literally two days ago, and I don't know why, but we went back to the social climbers house. And I looked over at Lewis, and he was on the phone to Anastasia. Basically, me and Saffron spoke on the phone, and we basically said sorry for everything, and we both apologized. So I feel like we're like, we're not friends, but we're not like beefing anymore. So that's kind of a good thing. I still agree with everything I said about her, don't get me wrong, but I feel like it's just better not to be beefing. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, I've said sorry to Saffron, so that's cool. I've been the bigger person in that sense. Morgs is like Loki, one of my biggest inspirations on YouTube. I wish I was lying. Daz Black. I used to freaking love this guy. And then he made a whole video about me and chatted bare shit about me. I would be mad, but then again, I'm not 55 and still making YouTube videos. So yeah, I guess it's all cool. <laughs> Millie T, aka my bitch. What's good? Can't wait to see her at Sitsi. Jordan Houston, aka Ruby Rube, my master. Like, a hey, also like, what's up? It is actually kind of mad seeing how many of my friends are on the lineup. Like, that does make me really happy. I feel like half these bitches on the lineup hate me. Ricky Dillon. A master. Massive shout out to him. He actually came up to me at the last Sitsi party and was basically like, hey, I love your videos. I find you really funny. And I was like proper held back by that because I used to watch his videos like three years ago and I used to be a big fan. So the fact that he said I was funny kind of made my night. So yeah, shout out to you, Ricky. Hopefully we can hang this time. Ben Morris is the ugliest guy I've ever seen in my life. Mark Ferris seems cool, but I only know him because of Zoella. So yeah, is that beefy? I'm not sure. I'm honestly not trying to be beefy. But, like, where would you be if Zoella wasn't here? <laughs> Shit. Looking for Lewis, aka James Charles. Can't wait to meet him. He seems super funny and chill. Lewis is the rudest person I've ever met, but I think that's why I love him. Jack me. I honestly want him to bully me in person. That would make my life. And that's honestly all I know from the lineup. I don't even know how many people I read out. And that's basically it for me reacting to the Summer in the City lineup. If you did enjoy it, smash the thumbs up button. I think I wanted to make this video just to let you guys know that I am actually attending and just to be like a little bit beefy, you know what I mean? Touch the beef is back. Oh my god, I'm looking here. 
I just saw bars and melody. I'm low-key a big fan. I'm not even taking the piss. King Kenny TV. I have no clue who this guy is, but his t-shirt says Netflix and chill, and I kind of want to throw up. I'm instantly a big fan of him. Let me know down in the comments if you're going to Summer in the City. I'd love to meet all of you. Don't forget, you can also follow me on all my social media sites. The links will be in the description. I'm also going to be selling my merch at Sitsi, so bring your monies. You can buy some of my merch. It's been sold out for so long, so if you do want a chance of getting it, like, get ready. Like, you will be actually able to get it. That's basically it. I love you all so much, and I'll catch you in my next video. Peace out, homies. Yes, boys, bye. Hey. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,